Hello everyone, this is a tutorial on how to use the Ubuntu Unity interface. So let's get stuck in. Um, the first thing is this uh, strip of icons on the side here. That is called the launcher. Um, some recognize it looks like the dock on a Mac. And this is where you'd launch all your frequently used the applications that you'd use every day. So you'd put applications here, whichever ones you prefer and you use all the time. Uh, I'll show you that a bit later. This is the where you'd log in and shut down. This is, you can see, I'm Peter VM. That's I'm the user that's currently logged in. I want to shut down. I just go there. I don't want to shut down. So close that. There's the time. There's no, there's time. Sorry. There's time. There's sound. Mail. The cloud. Whatever. Now the other main thing you need to understand on Ubuntu is you don't go through search through menus like you would through most computers. If you want to find applications or stuff that's not on the launcher you have to search for them. So I'd go here and let's say I want to look for internet. Let's say I want to go into a chat room. There it really comes up with stuff. It also gives you music options as well. If I want to draw something immediately it comes up with those options. So I don't need to. Have, let, let's say I want to put this application in the launcher so that I can use it because I draw things all the time. Let's say, for example, I'd hold down the left uh, mouse button, left click, and drag it wherever I want it to be in the launcher, and it'll, the icons will part. And I just release the left mouse button, and there you can really see it's appeared. Now let me launch that and then you can see that we launched it and now there I'm in my application now this thing at the top you'll notice it goes where it says untitled one LibreOffice draw many people will be wondering where's all the menu options where's file and edit that will appear as you move your cursor right to the top left hand corner if I move away it disappears again that's just to maximize your workspace so if I want to resize the window if I want to minimize, I can go back there for that. If I want to close it, I'd click there. I'll show you that just now. But my menu options will always appear there. If I'm, if I'm there, and if I'm, if I've got the window like this, I just go there. It'll appear. It's, it's almost like a Mac in the way it works. Um, so that's how it works in um, Ubuntu. Now I'm going to, if I, let's say I want to save this. Save as. I don't want to save it as anything. So let's close that. Oh wait. Now there's a thing I wanted to show you. Um, let me open another application here. Uh, Ubuntu one, for example. Let's say I want to switch between windows. Switch between applications. How do I do that? Because this is the other. There's no little taskbar at the bottom that most Windows users would be familiar with. So let me show you. I'm just waiting for this application. It's taking unusually long it'll appear eventually it's so kind uh, and I don't think it will oh well I'll find something else um, okay they have opened the text document now let's say if I want to go back to my drawing application you'll notice when an application's active it's what's running there will be a little um, triangle on the far left hand side of the launcher that shows you how many windows at the moment I can just see on LibreOffice draw there's only one window if there was two um, windows running um, concurrently there would be two little arrows um, there is it now if I want to go back to that go away from the text document back into Libre draw I just click almost to the far left side of the icon and it goes straight back if I want to go back to the text document I just go back there and that's how you switch between windows in Ubuntu um, this is they're trying to just maximize your viewing area but it, it'll take some time but you'll get used to this so that's how you go between just click to the left and you get there I'm gonna close that I'm gonna close that don't need them anymore now if I want to change let's say settings on this machine um, I would click here this is the system settings folder I want to change the logo. Let's change the background. Uh, let's say I don't like that one. I'll go back. Just click there to go back to this. All of the settings again. 
and that covers everything self-explanatory you can go through there find your hardware that sort of stuff um, close that and now let's see if I want to add um, now if I want to remove um, LibreOffice draw because I don't need it anymore or I don't need it in this um, launcher it's taking up too much space I right click and I go to unlock from launcher and it'll take it out so that's how you add and remove applications for the launcher now if I need to find some document that I've generated but I don't remember the name I can just go to um, you know here and this is like the my documents directory for Windows users got my downloads what I downloaded off the internet my home folder that's where all the stuff is pictures that's a shared folder it's not shared yet all the other stuff um, documents downloads there's a document I downloaded um, so yeah that's that's basically how you use it I'm gonna close this now but this is the home folder it's right up here it says files if you got all, all your files will be located in there. it's the home directory in Linux um, and I think that explains almost everything I want to talk about it but I hope that's self I hope I've covered everything that you want to know I hope this explains how to use Ubuntu um, thank you for watching um, let me know what you think comments what do you want me to cover more of um, and I'll see you next time so goodbye and thank you for watching